Hello everyone! I just got back from class and then I had a quick lunch. Um, I just had pasta for lunch, but I thought it'd be cool to do a little room tour so you can see what the space looks like and how everything fits and stuff. Starting off with my sink area. <laughs> Regular rooms do come with a little sink, which is great because I have all of my toiletries here. I have my shampoo, conditioner, and my razor my body and hand soap, I have my tooth tablets, my toothbrush, my hairbrush, and then my menstrual cup, clip, um, rubber bands, and razor blades. Here I have my skincare products and products that I use pretty often. No deodorant, um, Coco Kind skincare, sunscreen, and my lotion bar okay, and then I just keep my ID here because I need it every time I go in and out of my room it unlocks my door and then on this side I just have some lip balms and my face masks um, so that's it for this area okay now getting into the closet I have my door and I hang my bags on here and my towel and then I also have this little hanger here for my face wash towel my closet it's kind of messy it's hard to keep clean I just bought hangers the other day, so all of my jackets are so happy to be hanging. Um, so all of my jackets are here, and then I have these two scarves that I thrifted the other day hanging right here. And then this is kind of like miscellaneous. My backpack, beanies, um, hat, headband, and then those are some more face masks. And up here is like my sweaters and long sleeves. This is like my t-shirt and like thinner clothes and then my jeans and pants and then some yoga clothes and sleeping clothes and tote bags right here and then over here is just more sleeping clothes and kind of random clothes and then my shoes here and i also saved the cardboard from like these this box thing and i'm putting it here just in case my shoes get muddy and i need to put them on here under here i have like my more essential pieces of clothing like socks underwear bras and stuff so it's like easier to access and it's just right there and then up top i have my carry-on suitcase okay and now we get into the more room part of it my bed which is very simple <laughs> um the room came with this duvet and the duvet cover so that's what the blue sheet is and it also came with this pillowcase um, Rayma let me bring her baby pillow pet that has been my cushion. This is the bed and then the desk area, um, very simple. I just put my suitcase under there and then it also came with this chair and it has a trash can under there I haven't been using because I just used the kitchen trash can. And then when we moved in we got this, all of these kitchen essentials. And so I kept the box, and this is my hamper that I keep under here. Um, and then my desk just has, like, my laptop, my journal, my SIM card that I still need to activate, um, headphones, and, like, charger cords and everything. And then I did bring some Polaroids to use as bookmarks and just to have up. Those are my, like, favorite Polaroids. And then it does have, like, this really cute shelf space here. And I really wanted to fill it with plans and books and stuff, but I won't be here for long, so it will most likely stay empty, except for the some of the things I have here. I brought the wrong adapter, so that stays there. I have like my passport, my old wallet with other cards that I might not need, a speaker. So this is also like miscellaneous things. But yeah, the room is very simple. And it also came with these curtains. <laughs> and then this is like a tack wall I guess it came with like these tacks so I had this in my pocket so I put it up because why not and then I also have some affirmations and like inspiration here a heater mine only works for an hour and then I have to keep turning it on again so at night it gets pretty cold and it's hard to wake up because it's so cold but I like have to press the heater button <laughs> So that's my motivation. And then over here, it also came with this little drawer thing. And this is another box from like our kitchen stuff that I also kept because in my um, old room at home, I used to have a basket that I would put my yoga mat in because this is a cork material. 
and it's thicker so it kind of unravels sometimes but this one literally fits perfectly so I have my yoga mat I have my towel I have my yoga strap and stretching strap in there so that's like my yoga things and then here um, this is a camera bag of <laughs> some tomatoes and potato in here that I just need to put in the fridge or in the kitchen and then they also gave us this when we first moved in and then I have my water bottle my glasses this first drawer just has like receipts and things and then I have some food things in here from when we first moved in they also gave us like these and then I have my vitamin D in here and some other kitchen stuff and then I just saved these cardboard pieces just in case I feel like I might need them so yeah okay, one more thing in the sink area that I forgot about was the cabinet space so let's get into it that's my toilet paper um, face cloths because it came in a pack of four and then all those plastic bags I saved them from when we first moved in they gave us like three bags of groceries so I might need those for shoes or something later, so I just saved all of them. And then all of my back stock of soap, my toothbrush, my extra skincare, and um, shampoo bars and everything in there. So things I'll be using in the future but don't need right now in here. And that is my sink. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out a good angle for the camera. Right now it's literally sitting on my like water bottle. So um, I think this is pretty good. That was my room. It's very simple and very small. Um, I don't really plan on getting any room decor because I know I'm only here temporarily. But I mean, it does feel pretty cozy already. And just because it's such a small space, I feel like that makes it cozy itself. And then having small things like the pictures that I brought and um, my affirmations on the board and, and I really love my little sink space because it's like everything that I need right there. And then Roehampton does also have the option of accommodations with an ensuite which is an, a bathroom in your own room. That was like an extra amount so I didn't pay for it. I have a shared bathroom with three other roommates or two other roommates. Um, and then my other two roommates have their own bathroom so it's just us three girls sharing the bathroom and then the two guys who are in our flat have their own bathroom so it worked out pretty well actually um, but yeah if you do get the ensuite accommodation then it does come with your own little bathroom I think the sink is fairly similar and then it has just a toilet and a small shower and as for the kitchen it is shared among the five of us so we have like two fridges and two freezers and then we all have our own cupboards to put our food and pots and pans and everything in so it's split pretty nicely but, um anyways yeah so that's it for the room tour i hope you enjoyed watching i know it's just really short and simple because it's a small space but i will see you in the next video and i hope you're all having a great day bye